Hey everybody, Andrew here, back back uh, with some more good video game magic fun. Uh, today I want to show off Tetris 99. Yesterday I showed off Super Mario 35, which was a battle royal of epic proportions, but this is probably even more epic right here. Um, I've played a lot of this. I have only won one time. This is highly competitive, but you know the rules of Tetris. You know, the Tetronomos, the, the, you know, fall, you know, I don't need, I don't think I need to explain Tetris to anybody. Um, you make lines. Uh, and you're playing against 99 other human beings. This is not computers. These are actual people from around the world. Get ready. Here we go. But I, uh, I have played, you can, uh, I don't remember what button holds. Okay, it's L. Now, I like to save. <clears throat> I like to save those uh, big, long pieces. The the four with the line piece. I don't know what you name it. You see, uh, when you make lines, you send. Your lot of those lines to other people. And somebody's targeting me hard here. But that's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. We're not going to get destroyed, are we? We might get destroyed. Uh, we're getting out of this. We're getting to get out of this. I've been playing Tetris for a long time. I mean, I can remember playing this on the original Game Boy. Back in my day. Okay. Uh, I kind of want to use this. And then I can put you there. <clears throat> Strategies. I've played a lot of Tetris in my life. On the Game Boy, the NES. I think I had it on the SNES too. Don't quote me on that one. Yeah, see, we're already back to having almost a clear screen here, so I'll just stick you there. Yeah, you can prevent the other people's lines from coming to you, as you can see by getting your own lines filled out. Yeah, I've only won at this one time. I, I consider this quite harder than Super Mario. To be perfectly honest. Not giving me much of anything right now. There we go. Needed that one. I need a four. Really bad. And I've got one coming. Alright, when it gets red like that, that means you're in trouble. We're gonna get out of it. We're gonna we're gonna get there. All right, uh, sweat a little here. Yeah, we're done. I did not do very well that time. Placed 49th. All right, let's go again. Grab me a drink. While we wait. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Good delicious water. Nutritious. Hey, don't forget to drink your water, folks. I literally keep water in like both my living room and in my like room right as you come in my my house. Okay? Like people come in and be like, "Oh, hey, water." You come in from outside, you can just grab a water. All right, let's safe keep you. 
to you every oh man somebody's somebody's got it out for me <laughs> but yeah this is a lot more con oh shoot I didn't mean to do that okay damage control time here See, that, that's why I don't get at this as much. I can get a little antsy sometimes playing this and make mistakes. I'm not the best Tetris player in the world. I mean, like I said, I've played it forever. And I'm good at one-player Tetris because, you know, you got a different strategy when you're playing by yourself. You're not trying to... This is... Why did I not just already do that? Um, you know, there's no pressure to try to take out some money. Yeah, there we go. That'll work. Stick you down there. Stick you there. Good stuff. We're slowly getting things back to normal. Now, yeah, we're working good. And I took out their big lines that they were getting ready to send me, so double the awesome there. Put you there. So, what's your experience with this game? Have, have you are you guys big Tetris fans? Have you played a lot of this? And if so, what, what console or device have you played this on? It's on so many. And there's also so many versions of this game. There's so many different versions of Tetris on it. I think that'd be really cool to know what, what people, people have experienced as far as Tetris is go. Oddly enough, I think the Wii U might be the only Nintendo console that didn't have Tetris on it. I think the Wii did. Don't quote me on that. Man, we got a Tetris. Why not pull that out? Oh, all of a sudden, it's giving me really bad Tetris blocks. <laughs> yes, since we're getting another one. Sometimes it helps to look ahead to see what you got coming. Or you can strategize. <clears throat> but yeah, like with Mario 35, this isn't going to be a series unless you all really demand it for it. Um, this is just going to be like a one-off. Just showing off the game. I don't feel like I'm good enough for this to be a series. You'd just be watching me lose. Like, I'm getting ready to lose if I don't get good real fast. I got knocked a little bit down here. You. Getting a little, getting a little nervous here. Four. Sorry, I'm not talking. <laughs> Sometimes you just gotta shut up and play. And I think I done screwed myself. Yeah, that's it. That was a that was a that was a decent run. 
20th, okay, I can live with that. Alright, let's, uh, let's do one more. This is probably not gonna be a long video. Because I like Mario, I mean, what all can I show off here? You know, it's not like you have different levels with different enemies and different situations here, it's just Tetris. Something on my face. What the hell? All right, here we go. Store that boy. Man, I hate having to use that. Ah, oh, man, I'm not getting a good setup here early on. It's giving me really bad tetronomos. Still kind of is giving me really just not good. Yeah, luck does have a lot to do with this, honestly. Just depending on what the game is going to drop for you. Now we're getting a little, little bit better. I wish you could store two. Put <laughs> you have two of the big fours. Just ready to ruin someone's day with. I feel like the four square one, the one I'm dropping right now, I feel like that's the worst one, honestly. It would always seem it always seems like that's the one that shows up when you don't want it to. But store that. Alright, we're doing a lot better now. Doesn't mean I'm going to get her. this. I might show off something just to kind of fill out some time for this video after that after this matchup. Like show like my times for like the games I've played. Oh crap. That might be happening really soon. Let's uh, knock this down. Alright, knock down a little bit. And <laughs> I need a. There's a four coming. I have nowhere good to put that. Or that. Um, Slip that. Oh, crap. My controller. What? My controller just froze. It wouldn't do nothing. You know what? I deserve another matchup for that. Let's do one more. I don't like how that ended because of my controller. Stupid Joy-Con. You've probably heard me complain about these things in videos before. I don't like the Nintendo Joy-Con. I mean, if it worked right, you know, it fits in my hand just fine. But, it's so buggy and glitchy, I hate it. I really wish Nintendo would get away from this whole wireless motion control crap that it's been on since 2011 or whenever the Wii came out. And just go with a freaking normal controller. 
I know they like to be different, and I respect it. But sometimes less is more. You don't want the technology you're creating to hinder what you're trying to do. And I feel like the last... Because the Wii, the Wii, uh, the Wii U uh, gamepad, that thing rolled. Say what you want about the Wii U. It's poor sales. The name was stupid. People were confused about it forever and thought it was a Wii. I would know. I was working retail at the time. You know, the third-party support was non-existent, blah, blah, blah. Say what you want. But the Wii U gamepad was awesome. Fit into your hands like just cradling a baby. It was natural. And I never had any issues out of it. It was one of... It's actually one of my favorite controllers, to be perfectly honest. I love the Wii U controller. The Wii U gamepad. Right uh, do some damage control. Need a couple fours. Man, I'm not having much luck on this one. Now you give me the four. This one's not gonna last long either. I'm getting a lot of really good players. Yeah, it's over. That did not last long. That, that went terrible. But that's one on the end. That one ended right there. That's good. I'm fine with that. I'd rather lose by my own terrible playing than not being able to control what I'm doing. But yeah, let's go up here. You see I have two profiles. This one's just a backup one because of Breath of the Wild because it has like only one save slot in the game. <laughs> so that way I can play a different game if I want. <clears throat> Let's see. Profile. Here you see I can play, I've played Tetris 99, 30, you know, that's two hours. Mario 35. Yeah, as you can see, I've played a lot of Breath of the Wild. And this is not counting the time I have on my Wii U. I have like a ton on that too. Probably about as much. Stardew, 340. Yeah, I'm going to do that on the channel pretty soon as well. I'm surprised I don't have more hours on the Super Nintendo. Uh, Link's Awakening, 30 hours. Dragon Quest 11, 95 hours. Yes, I'm going to do that. I'm going to do Age of Calamity, 50 hours. Original High Warriors, 170. Demo version. I could probably just get that off my computer. I get that off my Switch at this point. I haven't played much 3D All-Stars because I think it controls bad. It's Paper Mario. 190 for Animal Crossing. But I'm not going to show all this. I just kind of wanted to show a little bit. Some of these games I need to play more. Maybe I'll do that on screen. Do that for Let's Plays or whatever. But yeah. That's Tetris 99. Uh, that game's not going away March 31st, looking at you, Nintendo. Um, it's going to be around, as far as I know, for the foreseeable future. So download it, play it, and enjoy it. Um, it's quite a rush. I think all of you would really have a lot of fun with that. But, um, yeah, the, I'm going to do different things like this on the weekends. You know, play little one-offs or, you know, some kind of chill game just kind of break up you know having to you know play such a huge undertaking like breath of the wild because that's going to be a long let's play and this is kind of my way of keeping a little bit of variety on the channel while i'm playing such a long game i, mean, I might do some stardew um you know we could play stuff on super nintendo as well I mean, maybe play some classic mario you know, at some point, I kind of want to redo some of my old Let's Plays that are done off of emulators and look really cheap. And I've got, uh, go to all software, just show it all. I've got, you know, I've got the NES stuff too. I'll play some stuff on there. Ooh, Mario Kart 8. I mean, we could play, we guys, guys, we could play that together. I could totally record that. 
I won't be able to record your screens, but mine. This is a fun little game. If you like Zelda, um, do some Mega Man. I've got a lot of games on here. I don't know if I'm going to do South Park. Um, the South Park guys are really bad about giving content ID stuff. Snake Pass. That's a that's a that's a fun little game. I had time. That's a good one. I've got Sonic Mania, Ori in the Blind Forest. I would love to play more of that. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I've I've got some some ideas for what's coming up. Animal Crossing. It'd also be a good like side project. Tales of Vesperia is on there. Final Fantasy X. That, that's all stuff I'm going to probably do in the future at some point. Lego games. I fully plan when that Lego Star Wars Saga game drops. That's going to be a day one let's play. And I normally don't do that, but that's going to be fun as heck. But I'll see you guys next weekend with more uh, whatever I decide to play. And I'll be back Monday afternoon with some more Breath of the Wild. All right, everybody. Thanks for watching. I love you all so much. Bye-bye.